I'll get it. Oh. Hello, Griffith Park Zoo, snake department. Hello, hello, what is this? Which one? This is Mr. Oxley. I'll see if he's here. No, 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 I said this is Oxley. Who is? I am speaking. Oh, you're Mr. Speaking. This is Mr. Oxley speaking. Oxley speaking. Any relation to Oxley? Barnaby Fulton, is that you? Who's calling? I am Barnaby. Oh, no, you're not Barnaby. I'm Barnaby. I ought to know who I am. Well, now, that's ridiculous. You can't be all three. Now, figure out which one you are, and then call me back. And I'm coming right down there. We were assigned to an isolated tribe, the Malombos. They'd never seen Americans before. It'll help you better prepare storing foods for the up-and-coming monsoon months. Also, supperware products are ideal for storing leftovers to help stretch your food dollar. You must understand, these people had been completely isolated from civilization. No one had ever outlined a physical fitness program for them, and they had no athletic equipment. I started them on simple calisthenics, and gradually worked them up to rudimentary game skills, and finally advanced competitive theory. I was patient with them, and they were eager to learn. They seemed to enjoy themselves. It was probably due to the advanced American teaching techniques that we were able to bridge the generations of isolation and communicate so successfully with them. Excuse me, sir. There's been a little problem in the cockpit. The no, cockpit? It's... What is it? It's the little room in the front of the plane where the pilots sit. But that's not important right now. The stewardess said that... Both pilots. Can you fly this plane and land it? Surely you can't be serious. I am serious, and don't call me Shirley. I know nothing about flying, but there's one thing I do know. You're the only one on this plane who can possibly fly it. You're the only chance we've got.